Liverpool will look to clinch a place in the top four when they host Brighton. The long, winding Premier League season will finally come to an end on Sunday with all ten games being played at once. One of those games deals with some high stakes as Liverpool look to officially book their place in next season's Champions League when they welcome Brighton. The Reds' form has plummeted in the Premier League of late, largely concentrating on winning the Champions League final later this month. Liverpool have failed to win any of their last three league games, losing the most recent one to Chelsea as the top four race was blown wide open. Brighton, on the other hand, would be coming into the game riding high on confidence and emotion despite their midweek loss to Manchester City. Chris Uden's men have secured their place in the English top flight for another season and would be looking to end there with another shock result. The reverse fixture, played at the Amex Stadium back in December, saw Liverpool hand out a 5-1 hammering to Brighton. Ahead of their latest meeting on Sunday, the hard tackle takes a closer look at the encounter. While the Liverpool boss could be without five first-team players on Sunday, he is down to his bare bones as far as midfield options are concerned. Alex Oxlade-Chamberlain will play no further part this season due to a long-term knee injury while Amrakan is also on the sidelines due to a back problem. Adam Lalana has only recently returned to training after recovering from his most recent injury, although he is unlikely to start. With no other options at his disposal, Klopp is likely to field Jordan Henderson and James Milner in midfield, with Trent Alexander-Arnold getting another opportunity to flourish in the middle. With the youngster being deployed in midfield, Nathaniel Klein should almost certainly feature it right back with Joe Gomez on the sidelines. The Englishman's campaign has been brought to a grinding halt after underwent surgery on his ankle injury. The fourth player on the treatment table is Joe Matip, who will not play again this season either due to a thigh injury. Meanwhile, Saudi Omain is a doubt due after missing training this week. Should he be unavailable on Sunday, we might just see Ben Woodburn get his long-awaited maiden game of the campaign, with Mohamed Salah and Roberto Firmino the other two players in the front trio. Probable starting lineup, 4-3-3, Karius, Klein, Lovren, Van Dyke, Robertson, Alexander-Arnold, Henderson, Milner, Salah, Firmino, Woodburn, Brighton. On Sunday, the Brighton manager will be without just Steve Sidwell, who has been struggling with a persistent back injury all season long and will be unavailable yet again. Hune will look to finish the season with another big-name scalp under his side's belt, which is why he is likely to name his first-choice team on Sunday. The only change should, thus, be top scorer Glenn Murray returning in place of Leonardo Uloa. At the back, Shane Duffy and Lewis Dunk will be aiming to frustrate and stifle the impact of Roberto Firmino while Gaetan Bong will have the unenviable task of keeping Mohamed Salah quiet. Dale Stevens will also be key in keeping Firmino quiet, with the Brazilian dropping deep every now and then. Anthony Knocker should again be a factor with his pacey outlet, keeping Andrew Robertson on his toes. Pascal Gross, meanwhile, should typically look find pockets of spaces and get into scoring positions to support Murray up front. Probable starting lineup, 4-4-1-1, Ryan, Bruno, Duffy, Dunk, Bong, Nakair, Stevens, Proper, Izquierdo, Gross, Murray Key Stats Liverpool have won five of their last six meetings with Brighton in all competitions, D1, netting 22 goals across these six, 3.7 per game. Liverpool are unbeaten in their last 21 home league games against promoted sides, W16 D5, since a 1-2 loss versus Blackpool in 2010-11. If Liverpool avoid defeat, it will be the seventh time they've remained unbeaten at home across an entire top-flight campaign, more than any other side have done. No side has scored fewer away Premier League goals this season than Brighton, 10, same as West Bromwich Albion. Mohamed Salah needs just one goal to set a new record for most Premier League goals in a 38-game season, currently 31. However, the Egyptian hasn't scored in two consecutive Premier League games for only the second time this season, also two in October. Betting odds favorable bets 1. Liverpool Asian handicap minus 1.5 at 1.5252. Both teams to score, yes at 1.95 underdog bets 1. Virgil van Dijk to score any time at 6.50 player to watch Pascal Gross the German machine. Photo courtesy, Bryn Lennon, Getty Images, Brighton's talisman has scored several important goals over the course of a memorable campaign, both for him and the club. The Seagulls will look towards the German attacker once again on Sunday as they aim to end their season on a high, possibly also handing Chelsea the final top four slot. Prediction Liverpool 2-1 Brighton. There also is the small matter of Mohamed Salah looking to set the Premier League scoring record for a single season.
the Liverpool talisman should, thus, be highly motivated to create history and guide his side to victory one more time. Brighton, though, should provide some stern resistance on the day. But, in the end, the hosts should have enough firepower to secure a narrow win, we predict a 2-1 win for Klopp.